Now the last thing I want to do once my once my map is ready to go, um, I want to print it out, uh, or I might send it to some other format. Uh, printing it out is is relatively straightforward. Uh, I'm going to file and then the print option here. I'm going to choose the color printers, um, and it, there's this image quality. I need to read more about that. I don't know if it makes any difference. Um, so that's fairly straightforward. Um, but what I'm going to have you do for several of your maps is make a PDF version of it. So it's something you could post on the web or attach to an email um, to send somebody. So let's figure out how to do that. Uh, so I'm going to go to File, and I've got an option here of exporting the map. Now here's where I've got a host of different uh, options that I can use for exporting that map. Default here is coming up as a JPEG file. I could send this um, to some other image formats, and the one I'm interested in is the PDF version. So I'll select PDF. I can set some quality settings here. This will dramatically increase the size of your file if you make this too large. So also depends somewhat upon um, whether or not you've got raster or vector data in there. If you've got vector data, the PDF is going to maintain the as vectors, so it's the DPI's won't, the DPI setting won't matter as much. So a few of the settings I want to make in here. I want to switch and look into some of these. Um, convert marker symbols to polygons. Some of your symbols, like your north arrow, uh, on some people's machines, if they don't have that same font, it's going to show up as a question mark. So I'm going to convert that, that uh, north arrow, which is a, an actual font, I'm going to convert it to a polygon. So it's going to work on anyone's um, computer. Let's see if there's any of those settings in here that I want to set. Uh, that looks to be it. Um, another one, the key uh, key one to make sure that you've set is the embed all document fonts. This used to not be something that was set by default, so make sure that's checked, so that some of the fonts you're using, like the North Arrow or, or the the title bar, will be included in the in the PDF file. All right, make sure in the, you're in the folder that you want to save it in. Change the name if need be, and click save, and then this will export a PDF that you can do whatever you want with. Uh, and just real quick again, notice that there were a couple of additional options. Um, export map. If you are going to post an image on the web, most of you know about JPEG files. Uh, you'll learn at some point that that's, it introduces some artifacts when the compression um, algorithms are run on it. In general, if you want an image file, use a PNG file for exporting this. Um, that works particularly well if you're taking your map putting it into a Word document. All right, that's exporting your map.